Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a T-Rex mixed with the Triceratops. It's going to be for beginners. It's just going to be the head. And let's get started, okay? First thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to go over here and draw the curve for right here for the top of the T-Rex brow, right? T-Rex brow. I'm going to pull out up for the top of the snout. Maybe curve over here for kind of the front of the snout on that side down over here pull back down back here pull up curve down over here curve right there for the eye and yeah right here it's kind of the eyeball on the inside or the uh, there you go Gonna go over here, line underneath, line underneath. Maybe pull a little bit of an angry line right there above the brow. So far, we're just it's just T Rex time so far. Down over here, pull up, and then one more right here for the cheekbone here. Line with it for the nostril. Down over here. back curve line 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 over here line here for the open mouth back of the jaw pull in back of the jaw over here Curve out for the kind of the back of the jaw right there, okay? It's really important. Up over here. Pulling up. And it's gonna go up over here. Sweet, sweet. So far, so good. Line over here, it's gonna be that skin area that um, dinos some dinosaurs have. Um, kind of like that skin as their mouth opens. And now we're gonna go over here and draw the teeth. And they curve inward, right? They kind of curve inward because they're pulling stuff in, right? Because he's a predator, um, or at least a scavenger, right? Um, but when he eats, it's pulling stuff in. So it's really just kind of simplistic teeth shapes like that. Curve over here. In. Line up, line up. Line up, line up. Right there. Fill it in. Kind of the back area to kind of give it a little bit of depth. Line over here. Line underneath for the neck and down here as well. Don't forget to hit the subscribe, click the bell notification um, if you want to have more of these mixtures. Line over here and let's go in and put the Triceratops part up for one. The horn right there. Curve in. Over here, down. And put some lines right here. Could throw that crest, a little bit of a crest here, but I think that's fine, the horns. We gotta make them look like horns. We're gonna look a little bit like rabbit ears, so let's throw a line over here, a line over here, a line over here. Kind of making it look very thin line, by the way. Make it look a little bit more solid. Line over here as well. And a lot of this now is going to be based on kind of the texture that you give this dinosaur, right? So you can draw like little, little tiny curves, like in certain areas, maybe in the cheek, like so. Line right here. 
Line over here. Curve, curve, curve. Same thing right here. You're giving it like these little curves to make it look like bumps, right? Line over here underneath the neck. And we're going to fill this area in right here to give it some shadow. Fill it out. Line, line, line here. Filling it out this way. Curve over here. Just gonna keep throwing on these little curves as you can. If you really want, you can throw on some spikes right there to give it a little bit of an extra effect. Don't forget to hit the like, by the way, if you like these mixtures or also the uh, just kind of the dinosaur videos because there is a lot of dinosaur video lessons on the channel, and this is probably one of the weirder ones. Line over here, line over here. Mm -hmm. Line over here, line over here. Alrighty, that's it. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time.